Hi friends, this is Mrs. Norning, and I'm gonna share with you a cool new tool we have at Milton West, which is called Abdo Digital Books. This is my fake course called Online Classroom, and so I'm gonna get started introducing you to these books. We're gonna begin with the green plus button, add a response. I am the sample student, so I'm gonna click onto myself as a sample student, and look at all these books that are right into the seesaw activity. So I have 10 different digital ebooks right in here. You can go to this arrow right here and you can put it away if you want to see the book larger. In order to open the book, you're going to look for the link icon, which is in the bottom left hand corner. And you're going to click onto it. It's saying it's in, found in abdudigital.com. You'll want to click this link one more time. And then it'll take you to Safari where this book is out on the internet for you to look at. You're going to begin with the blue arrow in the bottom right hand corner. This red arrow allows you to download the book but then it won't allow you to read it. Every single one of these will be read to you. So we're going to click this blue arrow. It is going to open up the book. There's a couple features here. On the left hand side is how you can turn the page. If you want to go back to a page. This right here is called contents. This is the table of contents and I can move between any of these chapters and it'll take me there. So let's say I'll click on the final product. If I want to start at the very beginning again, I go to the con contents and then I can go to pencils and it's the beginning. Or maybe I want to go to the cover again to start all over from the cover of the book. Right over here is the glossary. Every nonfiction book has a glossary with some words in it. And right here is the glossary. Again, I'm going to go to the table of contents right here. And I'm going to click on to it to start with the very first chapter called Pencils here. I'm going to click right on to it. And then there are a few more features. This green button, like when you see stop and go lights, green means go, right? So I'm going to click the green button and you're going to see that it's going to play for you. And then you'll see yellow words pop up. This button here, which highlights it, is for the yellow word. So it allows it to pop up the word so you can see them while it's being read. I'm going to get started. Pencils. It may be a small utensil, but it takes a lot of work to make a pencil. Okay. If I don't want the pencil or the words to be read, let's go on to the next page. If I don't want to see the yellow words, I'm going to shut this off, but then I can still play it. I'm going to hit the green button. Pencils are often made of cedar wood. Cedar is soft enough to be sharpened. When I was done, I hit the pause button because that means to pause. If I like and I prefer to have the words shown to me so I can track while um, the person is reading, I will turn that feature back on. And then I can go to the blue arrow to turn the page again. When I'm done and I want to go to Seesaw, I'm going to go in the upper left-hand corner here. I'm going to click that button and it will take me back to all the books. And oh no, I don't know where they're at. Right here, I'm going to click onto this where it says 7 out of 10. I'm going to click onto that button and look at all the books appear. And then if I want to look at ice cream, I'm going to click onto it. And then I'm going to look for the link again. I'm going to click on the link and I need to click one more time. And then it's going to take me to the book. Again, I want to begin by turning the page using the blue arrow. So I'm going to click on the blue arrow. And then I have the features, the green play button, and then the yellow pencil feature where the words are going to be read to you. I'm going to share that with you again. I'm going to hit the, the green button one more time. Abdo Kids. How is it made? How is ice cream made? Okay. When I'm done looking at the book again, I'm going to go in the upper left-hand corner. And it'll take me back to Seesaw, and then I can explore another book. I hope you enjoy this activity.